Hello there, um, welcome to Forest Applications with Google Earth Engine, hosted by Fundecor Costa Rica. Uh, we're going to be displaying um, some of the capabilities of uh, using two uh, groundbreaking technologies, the Google Earth Engine and um, it, the imagery that was captured with the use of UAV technology. So we are talking about a mosaic of images captured with UAV technology. We're going to display them here. This is actually 200 hectares of neotropical terrain in northeastern Costa Rica. Some of the neat things that we can actually look at here are um, a comparative analysis with the image in the background, just a native image in the background of, uh, of this uh, of this Google interface, we're talking about a uh, digital globe image from 2007. So we go to this area. We know this is one of our projects or interventions out there in the field, and we place the imager. We can actually see the growth of a forest plantation over the course of eight years or so. If we uh, drill down even further in detail, we can actually look at the river. The image that you're looking at right now was taken um, in 2007 during the month of April. That's actually the dry season in this area in Costa Rica. And you can see the level of the river. It's quite low. And the image on top was actually taken in October 2015, which is the peak of the rainy season. So we can actually compare um, the level of the river between uh, the two different seasons. Finally, when we work with uh, what we call the ultimate data gap, which is the layer between the soil and the canopy levels, we're actually concerned about each individual tree. and uh, We were able to see, for instance, the demise of these two trees that you can see here still standing in 2007. And then when we were able to retrieve this information and look at what happened to these trees after the flooding events of uh, mid-2015, they are, were actually washed away by, by the current. It's just a uh, small display of the capabilities of uh, UAV imagery high resolution data uh, running live on the Google Earth engine. In the second video, we're going to be looking at uh, another application regarding NDVI, the Vegetation Index. Thank you for your attention.